Hi, I'm T. Cooper. I'm a New York City makeup artist, hairstylist, and co-founder of beauty and grooming company Metro Look. Today we're going to talk about the perfect bun for gymnastics. I often say that the perfect foundation for a bun is a ponytail, but it's not always necessary, and I'm going to show you that now. So for this, you're going to need some hairspray or gel, depending on how tight you want your ponytail. You're going to need either a comb or a brush to smooth the hair back and you're also gonna need pins. So I'm gonna spray the hair, smooth it on the sides to tame the flyaways and just to give the hair some kind of memory so that it wants to go back. And I'm gonna comb it back. So now this is where my bun's gonna start. And you know what, I'm actually gonna just smooth the top of this just so that it looks good and I'm going to twist the hair really, really tight, as tight as I possibly can. And you see I'm using two hands to twist it. And I'm gonna twist it till I almost reach the bottom. You don't have to go all the way to the bottom because this is gonna be hidden anyway. So you see, just as I'm twisting, it's already creating a bun shape on its own just from me twisting it. That's what makes this so ideal. So now I'm just gonna wrap it around itself and tuck the loose end in the bottom. And this that's left on top, I'm just gonna press it down. And I'm gonna take my pins and I'm gonna pin into it. And being that this is for gymnastics, I would suggest that you use a lot of pins if you're gonna be flipping and, and dismounting and doing all that cool stuff that the gymnasts do. You do not want your hair falling apart. I've never seen that happen, but I wonder if it ever did. If a gymnast did a flip and just all her hair ended up in her eye. Things that make you go, hmm. And there's a nice tight bun there, and it looks really pretty. This is what it looks like from the back. And she is ready for her gymnastics meet. I'm T. Cooper, and thank you for watching. Bye. Mm -hmm.